Today, Elon Musk finally closes that six-month ordeal of a deal to buy Twitter. And Elon also finally told us why he's actually buying Twitter. Jack, are we going to talk about the X app? We may get there in the takeaway. We're going to talk about the X app. Yetis, the calendars were circled. Today, the deadline that the courts gave Elon Musk to finally do what he said he was going to do. Elon has two choices. Either today he buys Twitter for $44 billion. Or Elon has to show up in court on Monday in a suit with a briefcase and go through an epic trial against Twitter, which Twitter would rather die than lose. Now, there's one thing Jack and I know about Elon Musk. He doesn't like lawyers and he doesn't want to show up in court on Monday. So we expect him to buy Twitter today. There was actually an early sign this week that Elon was going to buy Twitter. On Wednesday, he changed his Twitter bio to say Chief Twit. That's a good sign. And then there was a second sign this week that Elon was actually going to buy Twitter. He showed up to work at Twitter. And there was a third confirmation. Elon's actually going to buy Twitter, which was kind of strange. He didn't show up to work with a laptop or a satchel. He brought the kitchen sink. Elon literally showed up at Twitter headquarters and he brought a physical part of the kitchen, the sink. Let that sink in. It's like Elon went to Home <laughs> Depot and then he went right to Twitter. <laughs> and then he tweeted, I'm at Twitter headquarters. Let that sink in. But yet he's the biggest thing Elon did wasn't change his Twitter bio, wasn't show up at the office, and it wasn't that random kitchen sink thing. No, Elon told us on Thursday why he actually wants to buy Twitter. He posted a long message on Thursday, and that's a big deal. It's a big deal because he's buying Twitter now. And everything he has said in the last six months, we had to take it with a huge grain of salt. Yeah, because Elon was like trying to wiggle out of the deal. He had buyer's remorse. Anything he might have said in the past six months might have been just to get out of the deal. So with that message and him firing the CEO and buying the company today, we actually believe these to be his intentions. Here's what Elon said about why he's buying Twitter. He believes that we need a common digital town square. The far right and the far left, they live in echo chambers. There's no central space where people actually interact online. That's what Elon said. So he said he's trying to make Twitter the common space where we can all engage in dialogue. And then he clarified, Twitter will not become a free-for-all hellscape where anything can be said with no consequence. He clarified, it must be warm and welcoming to all. So there's going to be some rules. And now that he's finally said why he's actually doing this, it's a worthwhile cause. That sounds like a worthwhile cause, Nick. We hope he succeeds, whether or not he got a good deal on that sink. So, Jack, what's the takeaway for our buddy over at Twitter? Elon also may rename Twitter X the Everything app. Yeah, Yetis, we should mention this, too. <laughs> Elon actually <laughs> tweeted this, like, strange thing a few weeks ago when he ended his lawsuit against Twitter. He tweeted, buying Twitter is an accelerant to creating X. X. The Everything app. The X app. The Everything app. That is something never achieved in the United States before. It's a new thing. Everything apps are popular in Asia. One app to rule them all, also known as a super app. Yeah, you may have heard of these before. Shopping, messaging, food delivery, payments, all of that. All of the apps that are in your phone, but in one single app. And we predicted, actually, in our <laughs> yeah, 2022 we did. predictions oh, pod. We did. We predicted that Twitter would become America's first super app. Literally 10 months ago, we were saying Twitter for a super app. It's pretty wild, but Elon seems interested in what we predicted 10 months ago. Making Twitter America's first super app. He just said it. But first, he has to transform this broken company into the world's common digital town square. Thanks for jumping in T-Boy style. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more pop biz that you need.